Hello and welcome aboard the 64 Tribute Hit and Run and what a beautiful sportfish boat this is. There are so many incredible features on this boat and I can't wait to show them all to you. So come on inside for a quick tour. After a long day of fun in the sun, this is definitely where you're gonna wanna hang out, the Hit and Run Salon. One of the first things you'll be impressed by is just how much space there is in here and the little touches from the alligator skin accents throughout to the hidden storage compartments. There's even enough room for a pull-out bed. Hola. Equipped with a top-of-the-line Crestron processor, with just a click of the button, you're controlling the entire AV system. And by the way, the computer is pre-programmed with about 70,000 songs. This is the master stateroom, and aside from a really comfortable bed, this room offers many other amenities. It includes two built-in nightstands, a 20-inch LED TV, ample storage space, and its own private full bathroom. Your guests certainly won't be roughing it either. Just take a look in here. The guest stateroom features a full bed, a 20-inch flat screen, cherry wood cabinets, and a large private full bath. Just down the companionway are the cruise quarters, a Bosch washer and dryer, and a third full bath. So, are you hungry? Let's head upstairs to the kitchen. Sorry, I met the galley. The Hit Run galley is equipped to satisfy the most demanding gourmet. The galley features four undercounter refrigerators, two freezers, a convection micro, a stainless steel sink, a four burner stove, and extensive Corian countertops throughout. My favorite feature is the mini bar. It's the perfect spot to sit back and enjoy a drink with friends. Now I wanna show you some things out on deck. Before we head to the bridge, I want to point out why this boat really is a fishing machine. Surrounding the rocket launcher, you'll find two live wells, a refrigerated fish box, an Escobo ice maker, a freezer, and up top are two rub triple spreader riggers. And I have to show you this. It's a built-in grill right on deck so you can catch your fish and throw them right on. Yum. Now let's head upstairs. Here we are on the flybridge, and you'll be happy to know it's completely air conditioned. The bridge features three Furuno nav nets with VEI screens and a carbon fiber dash. The 64 Tribute tops 42 knots at 2400 RPM. Her cruise is comfortable at either 32 or 34 knots while only burning 110 gallons per hour. The boat is powered by two Caterpillar 3412s, freshly rebuilt with less than 100 hours. So I hope you enjoyed our tour of the 64 Tribute Hit and Run. But to really appreciate this sport fish boat, you need to come see it for yourself. Here's to tight lines and good times.